Hey YouTubers, hey watchers, welcome back. In today's episode, I just did some cleaning inside my closet and found one of these, which is my portfolio case. So let's look through it. It hasn't been open for many years. So we'll get at it. So sit back, relax, and we'll get this show started right now. All right, my fellow watchers, here's my portfolio and let's take a look at it. Now with these, I'm just gonna keep them like this. This was a design for school. We had to do a logo for Paris 2012, which was the Olympics back then. And this was done around 2004 in my graphic design class. Now, this one was for a company where they were it was the United States communicating with Mexico, having a partnership. These two were for a contest for the community investment campaign for Middlesex County College. Uh, of course, didn't win, but got a letter of saying that they noticed me and they were gonna use it for um, future campaigns. Okay, let's look at the next picture. Okay, this was um, a small piece for a Civil Air Patrol patch. This was the original patch and this was the work in progress, but that never went forward. These were uh, concept ideas for a logo for another company. Um, that went through. They, they actually liked it. Let's see how it looks here. This, another design for college. We had to make a page layout. The teacher gave us a letter and we had to find an endangered species. And back then I did not know that the ocelot was an endangered mountain lion species in America. Thank God that changed, they're no longer endangered. Now this right here, it's, uh, I have to find the files, but it's a small printout I did for a girl. She was studying to be a social worker and she needed a flyer to help out with uh, senior citizens. And it went well. Okay, and this one, some business cards, letterhead, and stationary designs for my so-called company. Same thing with this, CG Painter Magazine. Created some t-shirts, different sizes. The cover, which you've probably seen before. I used that for college. More stuff for CG Painter. Uh, this one was actually, um, I restored this photo. We found it inside the house that we lived in during that time. My father was reconstructing the bathroom and found this photo. And he gave it to me and I used the photo and Went to Photoshop and did some restorations right there. I'm gonna have to scan these in and put them out so you can see them better. And here's a CD booklet with an actual band, but this is not their booklet. Okay, so paint and make it look like it's actual paint dripping. The Alaska Zoo, this is another mock-up. 
in my design class and like I said this was, was supposed to make a font now this was for my first graphic design job it was for a company Ram Products is still around they deal with nail and dental drills of course I'm guessing the price probably went up on these okay only one here this moved yeah sorry it looks dirty that's actually the glue under it this this piece hasn't been touched in over 10 years here's my biohazard sign this was for college we had to take any animal and actually recreate it using the word for it so I use mandrill and you can see R's, M's, everything around to make it look like the uh, mandrill. <coughs> some other pieces. This is not for college, just some CG art. In case people want to see. More CG art. This is a still life. I did this in 20, uh, 2002. This was in my nude drawing class. And during that day, the teacher put in still lives for us to draw. So I sat around and yeah, I completed that. Okay, another still life, 2002. Um, there's a shout out to my aunt, Haiti, Didi Haiti, as you call it. This is her baby picture. That's the original, and that's the remake that I made. And this was for school. We had to do a, a packaging mock-up. So, I use a strawberry shortcake. Now, this still life, this is just a bunch of pillows in a box and we just sat around, okay, draw it. Two more still lives. This one, I added more color and everything to it afterwards, which, of course, they asked. Um, I think it's a cow skull. And one more. Okay, my desert elf, Martyr, and the fairy of shadows. This is actually just something I created. And all right, that's it. So if you like that, please like, subscribe, leave a comment, and I'll see you in the next video. It will possibly be my other portfolio. So enjoy your day. See you next time. Keep on drawing.